So the first thing what I normally like to do is start by my kick. I want to um, just adjust the EQ a little bit or filter out a little bit of the highs and just have a little bit more of the low frequencies going on. So how I do that is you got the kick selected. There's two ways you can do it. Make sure that sound and module is selected. Then we want to go to you have engine type right here and you have your vintage modes right there um, you can use the S uh, the SP1200 or the MP60 now the MP60 doesn't have any um, any other extra filters that you can add to it but the SP1200 you can add uh, it has a low filter low mid filter high mid filter and a high filter so if you wanted to you can use that low filter on that so let's try it let's um and everything is through experimentation so let's try that and see how it sounds all right so if we wanted to go with that we can go with that or we can cut that off turn it back to standard click the arrow over two times until you get to filter mode turn filter mode on and now it's on low pass so now you have a little bit more controls over uh, how much filtering you want to do so you got your cutoff and your resonant so we can go ahead and make it lighter or make it lower All right, let's try that. All right, I like it. I like it right there where it's at. So let's go ahead and keep on moving. So now this is going to stay the same. We just go to the next pad. All right, since we got the snare, you want to keep the snare like in the, in the mid range. So let's go ahead and change the filter to. Let's go to a high pass. Now with this, we can go ahead and change the cutoff. We can take it up. I'll take it down. So I like the, I like the sound of that snare right there. All right, so let's go ahead and keep that there. Let's, let's play it back and see how it sounds. All right, we go with that. Now for the hi hats, you want to put them in high frequency area. So let's go ahead and put on a high pass filter. Turn that up just a little bit. Let's cut that on to high pass. Let's do the same thing with the crash. And all pretty much uh, the percussion that I have, I'm going to put into the high filter frequency. Alright, so pretty much I got everything set right around the frequencies that I wanted to be at. So let's play it back and listen to it.
All right, so I see the snare. I want to put a little bit more. thickness in that so I went on I went on and took the filter off of that one so let's go ahead and play it all right the hi-hats I want to go ahead and turn down this a little bit put a little bit more bottom on those Let's play it back. All right, let's put a little bit more bottom and the crash. Take everything down just a little bit. Alright, so I like where everything is sitting right now as far as the frequencies go.